many, many kinnis which address many, many different akudas, many different halakim of history in Klal Yisrael. Churban, Churban, Tetzara, Tetzara. It's all a kiyam of Kal HaMesabu from Yerushalayim. It's all michla. All the churbanos, all the kinnis that we say is the kiyam of what Chazal told us to be Mesabu. Al-Mesabu, Al-Yushalayim. This is all going to be the kiyam of how you Mesabu Yerushalayim. The kinnis have many different nukudas. A lot of it is zechreinis, a lot of it is negation, a lot of it is musr. A lot, a lot in the kinnis, a lot. Important to know that we can't obviously read every kinna and explain every line in every kinna. Yirmi spent his whole life what he did his whole life. You're getting Yirmiya's diary, all his irrigation, from this Kinnis, this book of Kinnis. There's a lot. Yirmiya spent, he was the Ish HaKurban. He was the person who called himself. Yirmiya referred to himself. He was born for Churban. That's what he was born for. Who wrote the Kinnis? The Bleza Kalir, most of them. Most of them were written by Bleza Kalir. Ebleza Kalir, according to many, was a Risha. The Rajma brings down, he was Rebleza ben Reb Shimon. Some say he was Rebleza ben Aroch. Some say he was a Risha. But Mechal Adeis, everything that he said and wrote is Ladiyup. As I even learned, the same way you read a Rashi, you read a Rajma, the Ladiyup in every word, because every word is Kailalat, that's really the Kinnis. It could take many, many hours just even to Vatai Shev Shutzvei Dai Kinnis. Can't do it, obviously. So what we'll do is we'll take out a Yisoyed, maybe one or two lines and paragraphs from every kinna. Vaz vil der kinna. What does the, the kinna want us to do? What does he want us to feel? What are we being the Sabu for? What exactly is the Avevus? So Yisoy Vesher Shavayda brings down an interesting thing, an interesting Yisoy. Shai Tez Periki Beis, he says, after Sudam Avsekis Yoimar, he has to say, Hareini Mekabal Alatzmi, Chamisha Inuyim, Lisabal Ulukainen, on four things. He breaks it down to four Yisoydas. Vos is Avelis. Vos is the Avayda from Tug. What are we doing today? Four things. There are four Yisoydas, four things that we're trying to accomplish. And that is to be Mesabal al Khurban Beis Hamikdash. Now we understand. Al Galus Hashkin Akdashin. The second thing is for the Galus Hashkin. So one is the Beis Hamikdash. The second thing is Galus Ashkina. The third thing says he said the Shayrish Avaida Agalus Am Yisrael. Am Kaddish. A lot of it is about Galus Yisrael. The Rabbi Nishlaim's Galus and Klal Yisrael's Galus. It's two separate in Yadav. The fourth thing is Alariga Sat Sadikim the Am Kaddish. What happened? Herod, the Ratzach, the murder of so much Eden during these Kharbanis. So this, according to the Yisaid Vishayr Shavayda, is what we're trying to address in all the kinnis. I saw the Kedusha Slavi is Maisif. Slavi explains, there's a safer called Shur Taiva, Hashis Dvarim. He says, you can make up a rule list of what we're looking for in the kinnis and the Avelis, it's Shloisha, Shein, Shisha. Three, which is six. What is three? Al-Churban, Beis, Hamikdash. 
Al Churban Yerushalayim Al Galus Yisrael, which is really what the Yisoyed V'Sher Shavoyed said, the Churban Yisamikdash, Churban Yerushalayim, Al Galus Yisrael. Now, we will continue through the Kinnis to explain is it about the Beis HaMikdash, is it about Yerushalayim? It's a very important Nakuda that gets overlooked. Pashtas we say it's available on the Beis HaMikdash. In Eicha, most of it is about Yerushalayim. Eicha, Yasha, Vada, Ha'ir, 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 Rabos, Yom. Yet in the Kinnis, later, there's going to be a lot about Yerushalayim much later, is it about Beis HaMikdash? Is it about Yerushalayim? We can talk about it later. But Churban Yerushalayim, Algolis Yisrael, and what are the six that come from these three? Tsar al Chiluch Shmei. The fact that the name of the Rabbi Yisrael is the Schalut. Fifth thing is Tsar al Siluk Hashchina, which we spoke about last night. Hester Panin, Siluk Shchina. To Yid, that's a tremendous tsar. That's what we talk a lot about this throughout the Kinnis. And we miss the Eidishta. It's Silo Kashina, the Hester Panin. Vav, the sixth thing is the Rebunish little tsar. Don't realize. Silo Kashina, the hair, which is very interesting. It, it, it was a very disraggish from it. It says that. Rabbeinu Shem is using Bashamayim. We are Baaretz. We have to connect the Shamayim. It says that there's a Zman during the Kinnis. You can be very close to the Eivish and ask whatever you want. Why? Because the Rabbeinu Shem is sitting on the floor with us. Sitting next to you on the floor. I think it's Rebichus Karetz that says this to her. Well, the Abish is far away. Here, the Abish is in Shiva with us. Shiva with us on the floor. So you could turn to the Rabbinic Shalai and say, This is Tsar Ashkina. We only understood that the Avelis is a twofold Avelis. We're, we're being Misabal, and the Rabbinic Shalai is also being Misabal. There's a lot of Talk in the Achreinim of Tshuva, which gets overlooked, Rabbi. We don't realize that today is a day of Tshuva. The Rambam we spoke yesterday. What's the Inu? Thursday, the Kailu. The whole kindness is a Tshuva thing, is that? That's Tshuva. So a lot of the things that we talked about today, Shas Maisa, Chachim, Tatek Zaybesa. We did things wrong. We'll talk to fix the things. I don't know, sometimes it gets overlooked when they talk about the churban and the tremendous loss that we have. Hush the tshuva, simple. Sometimes the most simple things is the ikr of all ikr. Hush the tshuva talk. If it's about wash and harder, it's about sinas chinam. These are things that we're going to talk to things better. Areas that we have to fix. Tap, pasha, play the pasha. A lot is a It's a lot of memories of the days that were to the days that are now. Hashivenu Hashem Eilachov and Ashuva is also a very big part of the kids. What do I mean? In the time where we misable of the other, a lot of the kinnis is about the asid hope that it's going to be good. I'll show you throughout the kinnis, even within the kinnis itself. In Eicha, you see, Eicha's mamish, uh, it's terrible, terrible. Yesh tikva, there's hope, and there's hashivenu, and chadashivenu kikedem. In the same sentence, in the same paragraph. A lot of it is Avelus of Avar, which is also the Amuna and the Tikva. It will be good in the future. Because I'll tell us Mashiach is born on Tishabov. 
in the Avelis. In the Avelis, there's a part of it about the Sheikh with Kumin, the Gutta Tegmon, Zalui Kumin. And it's a lot of the kinnis is about that. Aaron Akayin, what did he want? Aaron Akayin wanted by the Mikdash. He wanted to be part of the Mishkan, the Chanukah Samishkan. He felt bad, like who, like Shiftai. So the Rabbi Nishlein promised him, Lecha, what's yours will be kind, loyal. What I give you in the Mishkan you, will be forever. What will I give you? I'll give you Adlaka Samadar. Yudua, everybody knows this, right? The Rabbi Nishlein says, Aaron, you'll get to light the Menorah. Why is it Shulcha? God oil and it's kain oilam. How is it kain oilam? Aban says because we have till today we have menayra, we have the mitzvah lokas menayra in the, in the home. So you see, the menayra was liayilam. We once spoke a very interesting to her. Aaron's. What was Aaron? Aaron was that he wanted. Nichsifa, he had a kiss of the longing to be part, the tshuka to be part of the base Hashem, the Avedis Hashem. Shalcha, Kayim Liyayim, what do we have in Golis? What do we have in Golis? We have something which is very big, and that is as Medil, the Tshuka. That's Kaim Liyayla. That Chalik of the Avoida is Liyayla. A lot of the Kinnis is Kisufi, Gagul, the Beis Amikdash. There's many ways how a person stells Sut Avoida. You can stell Sut Avoida by doing Avoida. Even maybe more so, you can tell to Tavoida, the man's will, the chesed, the longing. There's a beautiful maizah for Reb Chaim Zonnefeld. Beautiful maizah. Reb Chaim Zonnefeld went with his Rebbe, Reb Ashlag. Reb Ashlag was the Rebbe of Reb Chaim Zonnefeld. They went to the Kaisel, mm -hmm. the first Shabbos, they went to the Kaisel when they came to Shalai. And the Rebbe started to cry. My Kabbalah Shabbos, Mikdash, Melech, Ir Malucha, Kumi, Tsi, Mitaycha, Fecha. Rav, Shabbos, Be'em, and Kabbacha, Behu, Yachma. So it sounds very big, right? Rav, Shabbos, Be'em, and Kabbacha, Behu, Yachma, Lelayim, Chemla. He started to dance in the middle. Only finding tans. He cried by make the shmel achir melucha. Who meets him? He takes a fecha. On mitten, on the simcha. Favos. Rav lo shevus be'emet habacha v'hu yachmoyim. The koinish loyim will have rachmoyus. Avelus and klal yisrael is always with hope. There's no such thing that we say that's miyush. It's so a very important Lekudah, Rabbi When you hasabble today, the Avelis is not a Yish, the Avelis is not a Dikoyen. The Rebjoinus Naivshitz is an interesting shayt. How did Yirmiya write Eicha, Eicha's been a Vua. And we know the Vua is only Mitech Simcha. It's a Meire de Ka'ara. How was Yirmiya able to write? Echo. Hein ashkin ashayra elamitech simcha. Nevuah needs simcha. And you tell it something, it's shayvshitz. It's beechrech. But it wasn't a chisar and simcha. Even when he wrote it, he wrote it from simcha. You know, there's a pasik. Si suaysa misayis kala misabu moleha. Si suaysa misayis means the science of freedom. Kala misabu molel, 
Those that, why? Because leather it is misample will be zaychet to the simcha. And Mechav Mizlachev says, no, you didn't understand the Pasik. The Pasik is saying, I feel them is misable. It has to be sisu oisa misais. How would is that? The hegish of avelus mitayich simcha. Avelus mitayich simcha. I want to tell you a politic is that. It's a toys with Rabbi Sai that Mamma Shai. A dove shall pell. Al Nari is Bovel. Sham Yashavu Bokinu. Talinu Kanere Senu. The end of the period of the Perikis. They hung up their musical instruments. Sham Talinu Kanere Senu. Ech Noshi Reshi Hashem. Chazal. The Alpid Shemaini Tilim Kufla Mitzayin explains that the Goyim forced the Eden to play music, to continue with the clay shear while they were going into Belus. <coughs> it's interesting how history repeats itself. The Nazis, Yamak Shemam, they used to make the Eden play music while they were doing their Mitzitas. So they said that they can't. Why? Because katsutsu, the hainas, they used to cut off their fingers. Fingers got cut off because they didn't say shira. Well, we're going to start using the clay. I make this to say shira in such a time. The nergu, because of that, they got killed because they didn't want to do this shira. And the medri says they were chayshish, that they're going to use it like they're saying shira to have a State in Medrash, that that's when the Rabbi Shalem said, and Meshkach Hech Yerushalayim. Rabbi Yerushalayim said, and Meshkach Hech Yerushalayim. We always think, and Meshkach Hech Yerushalayim, as we say it, Chazal tell us that Rabbi Yerushalayim was the first one to say, and Meshkach Hech Yerushalayim, Tishkach Yerim. I understand all the Abelos that we do, the Rabbi Yerushalayim, it was the first Mesabal of all these Avelis. It's actually the Rabbi Nishleil. We're being Mesabal in the Avelis of the Eibishter. It's a pelvic and medrash. Rabbi say it's a pelvic and medrash. Who said a meshkachech Yerushalayim? We say something we not, the Rabbi Nishleil said. When he saw this, when he saw that they refused to sing and play Shira, Sing for the Abay Dizar. There's our Taisris and Abay Dizar, Yuvamis, Pevava, and Aleph, that the B'nai Levi, there's a time on them that they didn't say Shir at that time. And because of that, the Chachamim canceled them and took away Maisa. It's a Taisis, Rabbi. Hell look at Taisis. They were punished because they should have said Shir. At that time, when they were leaving, and the guy would sing, say, Shira, sing, continue singing. The Levim should have continued singing. And because of that, they lost the mice. So I saw that Chaim Zaychik, the Tzadik Yudhata, explains, where is the Taino? I mean, it's the good thing. Fakat, you see the Eden. Because they didn't sing, the Bereshim said in Meshkache, Yerushalayim, Tishkach, Yemini. So it's a good thing what they did, that the Levim didn't want to say Shira. Says of Chaim Zaychik, they should have had a moon and Bitachin, and they should have believed with their heart the Yeshua cult. Sing Shira. Sing Shira. Don't give up. Because there's an amuna to the last second. Sing Shira. I'm probably saying every matziv, the Indian of the amuna of Kabula, is a chalik of, of the Avelis. It's a chalik of the Avelis. It's a chalik that the Gaula is going to come at any moment. I heard. 
Groyser Rebbe, I heard from the Chark, and I heard this from, from see the Shid. The Groyser Rebbe used to stare out the window throughout the kids. Why? Every moment of Shiyat's. Ayyid Kamalish let me Ayyush, it's always with the Geula Kumtanas. The Geula is going to come. We can read an entire Echo. Agansa Echo Kemele. Shemenu Hashem in Lechem and Ashuva, Chadi Shemenu Kikedem. In one minute it turns around. Yeshua Sashem Keheret Ayyid. Yeshua Sashem Keheret Ayyid. You know, when a person's in Dallas, and he doesn't realize there's anything wrong. So the Mela, Nishta Trach Begin the Chorbin, or Nishta Trach Begin the Geula. He doesn't think about either of the two. And a mensch is teeth. A mensch is teeth in the Gullus. Right away, right away, he's able to have this. I don't know if you look. Let's take a look at the.